and welcome to a brand new vlog and welcome to my channel if you're new around here i'm april i make weekly videos every sunday at 6 pm and today is a very exciting one and the next few a few vlogs you can tell it's early you probably would have seen the clip at how early it is it's currently five past four which means one thing we're going on holiday and we're going to Disneyland yeah we're heading to California today it is the 1st of October we are very early we being me and my parents you'll meet them in a little while probably when we're at the airport but yeah we've just got ready and everything done the final bits of packing so that's all sorted all the suitcases are downstairs but yeah I'm so excited and I can't wait to take you along so though I don't know how many vlogs there's going to be because I'm going to vlog it a little bit differently if you didn't know I've um, been to Florida twice and I've vlogged both of our trips so they are on the channel if you want to check those out and this is the second time that we're going to Disneyland but I've never vlogged before we've got lots of exciting things planned so I can't wait to take you along we've got Disneyland, Universal, Hollywood, Warner Brothers and we're going to have like some cool times in California but yeah it's very early and I feel like my brain isn't working properly but I'll show you what I'm wearing actually because I've gone with comfort today because the flight to California is 11 hours we are flying from Heathrow to um, LAX so it's a long one so I've gone with comfort got my Halloween bag ready as well got my Mickey pumpkin Hopefully this isn't going to glow in the dark under my seat. But yeah, last minute change to my carry-on bag. My mum is carrying my iPad. If you saw my packing video, you would have known I was a little bit stressed packing um, things. But yeah, I'll show you my outfit of the day. So this is what I have decided to wear. I don't know if anyone's going to be able to guess at the airport where we're going. But yeah, I've got this Los Angeles kind of eagle t-shirt and it's quite oversized and everything from H&M I've got some just standard black leggings but they're quite high waisted so quite comfortable and they won't fall down I've got some Nike socks and some New Balance I think these are the 574s but I thought these were quite comfortable and easy to kind of like take on and off if need be but yeah and then I've obviously got my Mickey Lounge fly and I've got my Disneyland Resort Spirit jersey because I thought where best place to um, wear it but yeah so yeah we're just waiting for our taxi to come and pick us up and then we're gonna head to the airport drop our bags off and then head to security I've got a few things that I want to buy and they're duty free so we'll obviously take you along for the journey you're probably gonna see my nails quite a lot on these vlogs but I got them done yesterday and I am absolutely obsessed so I thought I'd just show you I've got Mickey Bats, Mickey Pumpkin and a little Mickey Ghost how cute are they? and I've also got my Disneyland Resort try and Treasures um, wrist watch strap on how cool is that? and I've forgotten all on theme I've also got my phone case on as well very cool kind of matches my nails suitcases already we just had our last minute weigh-in mine's weighing 18.3 and my parents are both weighing around 20. we're all taking the little suitcase onto the flight as well just for extra purchases on the way back but yeah this is a regular occurrence in our house when it comes to suitcases on our Florida travel day I forgot mine so yeah but the videos actually work Thank you. 
Moin zu Leute! Mein Auto ist Thank you. Ich hoffe, wir haben auch so. We have made it through security with no hitches whatsoever. It is quarter past seven, so we are through super early. So I think we're gonna go and have a look around duty free and stuff, and then go and have a look at kind of what food we want. You can see my dad in the background and my mum. Mum and dad, wave. <laughs> You'll meet them properly probably when we go and have something to eat. Yeah, I think we're just gonna go head to duty free and stuff, and then find some food. Yeah, super quick and easy, all sunglasses hot. I think I want to look for some sunglasses as well. But yeah, we were worrying about nothing. We got through so easily, didn't we? But yeah, now having a look at the sunglasses. I wanted some Ray-Bans, but I don't know if I'm in the market for one. I think we're all so hungry at the moment that we kind of want to eat before shopping, but yeah, yeah. A cup of coffee sounds like a good idea. But yeah, just take you along for the journey. But sorry, I got distracted there. Um, Checking was easy. Or well, just in the Man City shirt. Um, Checking was easy, dropping our bags off. Security was super easy as well. But we've just got here that little bit much earlier. They've gone into JD Sports, so I'll we'll stay out here. Oh, this isn't a very good lighting. But yeah, checking was super easy. Um, bag drop was easy and stuff. But yeah, we got here a little bit earlier. And I think it makes a difference. And it's a Sunday, so yeah, but very excited. I had a little bit of a sick feeling earlier, but I'm so looking forward to getting on the plane. Got lots of down things downloaded and stuff. But yeah, it feels good to be vlogging again and traveling again and in an airport. We think we might go to that, is it London's Pride for breakfast? But we're just coming down to go to the Big Duty Free shop because I want uh, a perfume. Oh, the Starbucks. I didn't, I said I wasn't gonna get one, but you never know, I might cave. I might need the caffeine. But yeah, there's a big world duty free over there, so we're gonna go there first, get shopping out of the way, and then get something to eat because we're hungry. But this is where all the, like, the posh shops are. It looks like Louis Vuitton is going to go there, but that's under construction at the moment. There's Gucci, YSL, completely out of my budget, but yeah let's go to duty free oh yeah look all the posh shops are down there and stuff oh one day gucci one day little robot cleaner <laughs> last time we came we didn't have a chance to look around any of this because we were far too rushed and stressed because there was such a queue with security and everything. Yeah, let's head through to the mothership of World Duty Free. I've never been one to get alcohol from the Duty Free. I don't know if people do. Sweets on the other hand though, I could be tempted. Mum, shortbread. Look, there's like special ones. There's like special royal family ones and UK ones. Lots of big treat bags. Oh my god, look at the size of those smarties. Oh, they're mini ones. Oh my gosh. Wow. Toblerones. I mean, this is an American size, really, isn't it? Wow. Oh, see, just spotted my favourites. Oh my god. <gasps> the size of that. Oh my god. Oh, I'm tempted. Look at the size of that. I don't know where Milker is. 
We're looking for Milka for one of my mum's friends. But who knows? Time to get my holiday fragrance. My favourite. I think I'm going to go for Peony and Blush Spaders, which is one of my all time favourites, but I want it to top up a bit, so. Time for food. I think I might go for the breakfast. I was going to sit here. Breakfast waffle. Breakfast waffle. The very British thing of not saying, no, that's not mine, <laughs> so you just swap it after. <laughs> Me and my dad have got lattes, like and my mum's got tea. Why yeah. like the tea a little milkshake? I caved and got a coffee. <laughs> I went for the breakfast waffle. My mum got quite a big bit of toast with scrambled egg. And my dad went for jam. salmon yeah. on toast. And ate the pot jam with some random leaf with my scrambled egg. Right. <laughs> yeah, we're going to tuck into this. So hungry. I think that breakfast was a success. Did you enjoy yours, Mum? Yes, thank you very much. This is my mum, Louise. People say we look like sisters. Trying to sort my starving card out. Because who has forgotten her pin? Me and the password. I'm raising my eyebrows behind the screen. And this is my dad, Jason. What did you think of your breakfast? Okay. <laughs> yeah, let's see how my mum gets on with doing this. But yeah, they're going to record a code. Okay, I won't put her under pressure then. Yeah, breakfast was good. So for three of us for breakfast, it is costing £45.60, which is pretty standard. Uh, Dad's was the most expensive one. Yours was £3.50, that's not bad, is it? Oh, for, and £3.95 for the scrambled egg. Mm. Yeah, so it's pretty standard, but it's filled us up until the plane. This is the reality of travel day with my parents. My dad, this is the second time he's been into JD now. And will he buy anything? No. And he's just looking at the same things over and over again, going, oh, I want that, but he's not actually probably going to buy any. Yeah, look, so he's looking at the same things again. Another pair of shorts. Yeah. I can't tell you actually how many pairs of shorts he has because he's probably lost count. But yeah, this is our life and it continues in the airport. Oh, oh, progression. This is a progressive from um, last time. We're just in WA Smith's getting our plane snacks and look, they have Werber's popcorn, which is what me and Andy brought back from Florida in the Werther's stall. It is priced though, £6.50 free for two though. Wow. Mm, but mmm. You'd feel very sick after eating that. £6.50. What the heck? Pricey. Got Pringles. Three ninety nine for those. Got all your kind of big packets of sweets and stuff more shortbread <laughs> look at those many packets of digestives <laughs> tell me you're in a British airport without telling me you're in a British airport <laughs> three pounds for those oh my gosh again is it a British airport without the Harrods and look, they've got Christmas stuff out already. How cute are those biscuits. A lot of it is like gifts and bags and stuff, but you can get the cheese and the marmalades and jams and stuff just in case you want something. I like those bags, they're cool. Head into our game.
<laughs> Mum thinks the pilot in front of us might be for us because he's a United one. Off we go. We're at our gate. It is 10.30 and boarding begins in a few minutes. That looks like a very small plane to be taking us to Los Angeles, but hopefully that's our one. Yeah, we've got all of our snacks ready for the plane. It's quite a busy flight by the looks of it. There's quite a few people waiting, but yeah, I can see some Virgin planes over there behind ours. Looks like they finished loading some stuff by the looks of it. Yeah, very excited to be heading on. We're heading on. We're in our seats. Mum's already looking at the in-flight entertainment. Dad's got his up as well. We're just like after the wing. So this is we've kind of got two windows. Got this window as well. Yeah. Pretty decent leg room here. I'm like five foot eight and I've got quite long legs. I mean, you can't really compare from my mum. She's got loads of leg room. It's like she's in first class. <laughs> but like my dad's got quite enough room as well. Yeah, pretty roomy. Very chuffed. I'm pleasantly surprised with the entertainment. There's some Halloween stuff on there. Halloween horror, that will be my mum and dad's um, expertise for me. Treasure hunt, actor spotlight, blockbusters. Loads of different stuff. And then you've got the new releases as well. So you've got Ant-Man. Avatar, the new one. Fast X, I think we've got Elemental. Yeah, Fast X. Guns of the Galaxy, the third one. Lots of different stuff. I have downloaded loads of stuff from my iPad as well, so. Oh, Little Mermaid, might have to watch that again. I don't think we'll be short of things to watch to be honest, will we? Yeah, yeah loads of different stuff. I was going to watch Hocus Pocus first, but I've just seen that <laughs> In the Heights is on here, which is from Lin-Manuel Miranda who does Humpton. So I haven't watched this in ages and I absolutely love it, so this is going to be what I'm going to watch. Very well, 
in you. Well, I would say that. <laughs> I would. Your hands have gone white through the ground ever so tight. <laughs> but yeah. So cool. I always am amazed at how cool flying actually is. Oh, we got an announcement. It's been we've been in the air about half an hour. Cheese, 
pretzels. Oh, brilliant. Absolutely love the pretzels. Yeah, it's just gonna watch the rest of the Kardashians. I'm very behind. I'm only on season two at the moment. But having my iPad has been a godsend. One of our suitcases is here already. My dad's just gone on and got the other one and we're looking out for a green one now. That was good. We have a story to tell about the security later, but we'll do that when we're at the hotel. But the same thing happened last time we came here. So we weren't surprised. It's the sweaty hands, man. Wait, can you see our green one? We've just now drove up. We're at LAX. So. So this is our hotel room. We're staying at the Sherrington Park Hotel in Anaheim. We've got two queen beds. <laughs> My mum's <laughs> making full use of the sweet chair. chair. On first impressions, it feels like it's been newly renovated, which it probably has. You've got a really big kind of storage um, bedside. Oh. But a massive safe there, that's going to 
put everything you'll be able to fit everything in there got a pen and some paper privacy thing a clock telephone those beds look so inviting you've got this little storage bit here that's got your tea and coffee facilities ice buckets and free water then you've got the fridge here decent sized fridge be able to fit some drinks and stuff in that you've then got and this is the issue that I've found with this hotel already this is the only storage you really have other than the two drawers over here so if four people theoretically were going to be in here that would be a little bit of a problem but yeah that is like the wardrobe area you've got some drawers here everything's very hard to do and I don't want to break my nails doing it you've got like a little seating area I'm guessing you can put your kind of um suitcases on there you've got a table here that's got loads of plugs on it that's quite cool what do you i don't know it says up and down but i don't really know what it's meant to do got some lights in there a massive tv that's massive. and then we've got a balcony this is our view we haven't got a park face of view but i think we waited so long in the line to um check in that we're happy with it you can see the pool down there i think we're going that way in a little while to target to pick up some provisions yeah it's a nice enough kind of bit you've got a chair that my mum's modeling there another bedside table with some lights and some cool artwork complimentary free wi-fi yeah so that's the main bedroom. You've got the full length mirror there. Well, that would be good for outfits of the day. And it's kind of got like some hooks that you could hang some bags and stuff on. And then the bathroom is in here. You've got some sliding doors. That's quite nice. Let me see if I can figure out. There you go. You've got a massive mirror. Little sink area got a hairdryer down there toilet shower you've got some nice toiletries there and really shallow bath and you've got your towels and everything there might have to ask for some more because that doesn't look like it's enough yeah that is the room very happy with it i think i've naturally gone towards this bit for some reason so i'm going to I think I'm going to go for this one. Yeah, I think we're just going to refresh, chill for a bit, and then probably head to Target to get some provisions and kind of settle in for the evening after that. Just, we're very tired, we're flagging a lot. I think it's like gone midnight now, our time, but it's only five o'clock, so we've made some good time. I think we land at about 20 to 3 today, so not too bad but yeah probably check in with you once we're kind of deflightized a little bit and unpacked a little bit and then heading to target look at the photos that are outside our room so cool can't wait to visit you we're now heading to target Oh my god, there's some more. There's some more photos as well. How cool. Yeah. Oh, look, you can see Guardians of the Galaxy. Oh, look. Oh. Is that the back of Cars Land? Yes. How cool. DCA, yeah. Oh my god. Oh, we've got to go into the lift now. <laughs> I'm getting distracted by Disney already. This is what the hotel looks like just on the ground. Very tall. We're on the 11th floor. 
Oh, it's so nice. It's like just a, a nice summer's evening, isn't it? Seven till ten, the um, pool is. And this is the lobby of our hotel. So we checked in earlier. Very nice. Little bar over there. And we're heading to Target. Which is a 20 minute walk from our hotel. We are just in Target. We made it. We walked to our from a hotel and it took about 20 minutes, but it is very busy in here and a lot of the shelves are like completely empty. So I don't know how much we'll be able to get here. Might have to have another trip at some point, but just looking down the American candy bit. Oh, I think these are the ones I wanted to try. Crunchy cookie. I was hopeful they were going to have some vanilla coke, but they don't. They seem to have loads of other flavours of different things, but not vanilla coke. This is how you know you're in America. The Halloween section is massive and amazing. <gasps> There's loads of pumpkin spice. <gasps> pumpkin spice cookie mix. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, there's so there's many bits. Here. What's that? Pumpkin, pumpkin bread. bread. Oh, I like pumpkin bread. Oh my god, then. is that jello? Oh, orange jello. I was going to say. Full assortment Ghirardelli. Oh my god, there's so many. Oh! <gasps> Pumpkin spice. Well, there's originals. Mmm. Oh, there's so many different things. Maple Lindor. Look at the Halloween costumes. You got a hot dog. My brother tried this on last time we came. And a, is that a taco? So, oh, that's cute. I've got a different version of these from years ago, uh, from when we came last time. Love the decor in here. Oh, I wish I could come home with it all. We're looking at the cereal now, and there's all different pumpkin flavoured cereal. We've got Special K, pumpkin spice. Pumpkin Spice Cheerios, Apple Pie Toast Crunch, Pumpkin Spice Frosties, and Pumpkin Pie Spiced Frosted Mini Wheats. The UK could never. So I think the last thing I filmed in Target was us looking at the cereal and I think the tiredness hit all of us because we literally just walked around the rest of the shop like zombies. But here is my little Target haul of bits that I've picked up so far. There's a, obviously a theme of things that I've picked up. Halloween or pumpkin flavour. So I've got some pumpkin spice Oreos. I'm showing you these now rather than the haul because I don't think a lot of these are going to make it back home because I'll probably get eat them. i got some Goldfish Duncan pumpkin spice Graham um, little snacky things. Vanilla cupcake ones. I got these in Florida earlier this year and I absolutely love those. I saw Brogue and Tate put these on her um, Disneyland vlog and I had to hunt them down. Very intrigued with that. And these two are for Andy. He absolutely loves the white chocolate Reese's Pieces so I thought getting the ghost ones. I got a pumpkin sliced cake pack in the bakery bit, I thought these would be nice for, as a little snack or for breakfast. I got this for my um, friend Beth, her boyfriend. Apparently he absolutely loves these, so I picked those up for him. I uh, got some bottles of Coke, because these were about $5 each in the Disney park, so I thought I would stock up on those, ready to take them to the parks with me. And then I'll just show you my two coffees that I got quickly. My mum's making herself a tea. Tell me you're British in America making a cup of tea. And then I got 
a Dunkin' Donut iced coffee French vanilla and then a Starbucks white chocolate mocha that you can't get in the UK I don't think I've not seen that so got some orange juice as well my parents got some oat milk but yeah that is our first little target haul of the trip I'm sure there'll be many more visits there I'm sorry I didn't take you along further around the shop but it was super busy there who knew it was Sunday evening in Target it was so popular but yeah I think we're gonna kind of turn in for the night that's my mum making a cup of tea in the background no no that's fine <laughs> Um, oh, but that's my dad yawning as well. <laughs> he looks like he's about ready to go to sleep there in his granddad chair. <laughs> oh, Jordan, uh, it is five to eight. We were, had every intention of going to Blaze Pizza this evening, but I don't think I can move past the point of past being Aaron. of being tired that we just aren't hungry anymore. So I think we're gonna have a little snack of something that we bought in Target, all of which are sweet stuff by the looks of it on my side but yeah and i think this will conclude the travel day vlog to california so i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for following along and i shall see you next week for a brand new vlog uh we're bimbling around kind of the anaheim area tomorrow not doing much we haven't got much of a plan because the um, week after we will be showing you our first Disneyland vlog and the Oogie Boogie Bash which is very exciting but yeah I'll see you next week for a brand new video at 6pm on Sunday bye